In this Unity tutorial I will show you how to make this patrolling AI which moves between a few points. So let's get started. First you have to go to this GitHub repository, I have a link for this in the description. Then you'll click on code and click on download zip. Then you will unzip the folder. Now open up this folder and drag the nav mesh components into Unity. Then you will click on yes. And in this Unity scene all I have is this cube which can move around. First we'll create the ground which the AI is going to be able to walk around on. So right click, go to 2D object, and go to sprites, then go to square. I will call this walkable. I'll make it larger. So this is where the AI is going to be able to walk. And I will make this invisible. Now add a navigation modifier. Now we'll create an empty game object called nav mesh. And remember to set the C position to zero and actually also do that for the walkable area. But on the nav mesh, we will add a navigation surface and also a navigation collect sources 2D. Now click on rotate surface to XY and click on bake. This will bake the walkable area, but you might notice that the walls are still walkable. So what we'll do is select both of the walls and then add a navigation modifier. Then check override area and set it to not walkable. Now if we click on nav mesh again and click bake, the walls are no longer walkable. Now let's create the patrolling AI. So right click, go to 2D object, go to sprites. I'll create a circle, I'll make it red. And remember to set the C position to zero. Then we'll add a nav mesh agent. And now we need some points for the AI to move between. So right click and I'll create an empty. I'll call this point one. Remember to set the C position to zero. And let's place one over here. Then let's place one over here. And then lastly one over here. I'll just rename them. And I'll rename the circle to, to patrolling AI. Now let's create the script which handles all of this. So right click, go to create and do mono behavior script. I will call it patrolling AI. Open that up. First we will add the library unity engine.ai. Then we'll add a public transform array called patrol points. So this will be all of our points we just created in Unity. Then we'll add a private int called current point index. I'll set this to zero in the beginning. So this is the current point which the AI is going to be moving to. And then we'll add a private nav mesh agent called agent. And in the start function we will set agent like so with get component nav mesh agent. Then we'll do agent dot set destination to be patrol points current point index dot position. So it will basically just start from the first index in the patrol points array. Down here we'll do if not agent.path pending and agent.remaining distance is less than 0.1 float. Then we can set current point index to be equal to parentheses current point index plus one modulo patrol points dot length. And then lastly we'll simply do agent.set destination to be patrol points current patrol point index dot position. And the last thing we need to do is do agent dot update rotation to be false and agent dot update up axis to be false too. This is important for 2D games. Now we can go back into Unity. In here we'll click on our patrolling AI and drag the patrolling AI script onto it, like so. Now we need to assign the patrol points. So click here three times. And we'll assign point one and point two and point three, which is here, here, and here. Now let's try to click play. And as you can see, it moves between the points. So that is all for this video. Thank you so much for watching. If you liked it, please subscribe.